Hello, Karma Loop watchers. It's me, Stevie Boy. You may know me for designing glasses for Lady Gaga and all your favorite celebrities. Well, I came to kick it here at Karma Loop, and I'm definitely enjoying myself, especially with this wonderful set that they designed specifically for me. So, stay tuned. Where do I design? The question that I never get. People always assume that I just design in some manufacturer because of my products and the quality of them, but I actually hand make all of my pieces um, at my loft in Baltimore City and my studio in Atlanta. So those are the two places I majorly work out of. Wow, how did I start it working with celebrities? Um, originally it actually happened, there was a magazine in California that was really interested in my shades. They didn't tell me who was going to wear them. The first celebrity to wear my shades on the cover of a magazine was Eva Marcel Pickford, formerly known as Eva uh, Marcel now. She's an actress, she was a model, she won top model at one point. Um, that was the first celebrity and then literally after that I, I got like a hundred sales overnight. Um, I was like, oh my gosh, the pressure. And the next thing you know, I just started getting all of these celebrity contacts. A lot of celebrities started hitting me up personally, and that's why I have so many relationships with them. And um, it became friendship, and then I met more celebrities through the music industry and through the fashion industry. And then I just happened to meet this random girl named Stephanie one day, and um, she's like, I like your shades. Who are you? You're crazy. I'm crazy. Let's link. Design for me. And I designed shades, and now you know her as Lady Gaga. So. That's how I met Gaga, and that's how the whole celebrity train started, in which it's an evil train that I ride, and I love it. If my cell phone was to get lost and people were to go through my contacts, who would be the biggest names in there? That is so confidential. Um, my mother, she's so big. She's such a big star. My father, he's a big star. I'm, I'm being sarcastic, but... Um, Jeez, I'm gonna get in trouble for saying that. Um, I mean, I'll stick on the urban side uh, of music. I'll just stick with hip hop and I'll just say Trina or Little Kim or Nicki Minaj. Don't ask why I put all three of the female rappers in the same category, but it's, th it's out of those three girls, those numbers in my phone. I'm gonna get in trouble for doing that, <laughs> but okay. If I could collaborate with anybody, anything, anywhere, anytime, it would be Grace Jones. I bow down to her. I honestly just want to get up and scream and take all my clothes off. And she's like, Grace Jones rules the world. Uh, Grace Jones is somebody that I literally, I can't live without her. She's the reason why I'm so crazy. She's the reason why my fashion is so dark and so, you know, just me. She's Grace Jones. And she is my mother and she doesn't know it. I wish she didn't throw me in America and just leave me out here with all of these crazy Americans. But it's okay. It's okay, Grace. I love you. Please collaborate with me, please. So currently right now I am filming something and I am showing people that I do more than shades. I am a personality. I am not just somebody that makes shades for Gaga and other celebrities. Um, as you can see, I am wearing some accessories that I made. Uh, oh, this hoodie scarf I made as well. I do make clothing as well. I'm just not making them, t uh, wearing them today. This is something that's also from my line that I teamed up with Kobe Keen, by the way. And um, yeah, so I do more than just shades. I do accessories and I do clothing, but specifically, obviously the eyewear is something that I um, started. So yeah, check that out whenever it comes out. It's gonna come out. <laughs> okay, so once again, back to the goggles, I decided to create gold glasses. And when I made these, I was thinking about Anna Della Rosso, the editor of Japan Vogue. I have a really good relationship with her and she loves gold. She's obsessed with it. And she actually priced one pair of, no lie, it's in Vogue, so check it out. Before I even tell you, cause you're like, what? But she priced one pair of my glasses for $52,000 because she loved them so much. And that was the biggest thing that has happened to me yet when it comes to someone giving my, a price for my glasses. So ever since then, I have been making all of my glasses in gold. <laughs> so yeah, check these out, they're pretty dope. Really simple, I think the typical person that just wants some glasses that are funky can just throw these on compared to my other glasses, so yeah. Those are SB shades. Hey, what's up, it's me, Stevie Boy with Karma Loop TV. Reclaim your TV, coexist. SB. Rah!